On conservation land west of Beaverville and Boxborough, Scott Smyers gears up for a salamander hunt. No access, so follow me. Let's get some access. <laughs> the wildlife biologist with Oxbow Associates is a regular here. Not only did he walk through these woods as a boy, he is one of a small number of scientists who track amphibian and reptile populations in central Massachusetts. But here's the pond area down here, so you're going to have to do a little bit of bushwhacking. On a cold afternoon in late autumn, Smyers dredges through this freezing pond looking for salamanders. Now we've got a proper hole. Salamanders are interesting because they are one of the most complex animals still capable of regeneration. 500 million years ago, most creatures were like the jellyfish. A lost tentacle could regenerate overnight, a bad scrape gone and scar-free within a few hours. Throughout evolutionary time, however, most of these abilities were lost. According to Smyers, salamanders are the exception because regeneration is essential to their survival. If you broke a piece of the, its tail off, it would wriggle as a distraction. And even when it's not attached to the animal for minutes and minutes and minutes. And uh, that's presumably a defense mechanism to, you can take my tail and I'll deal with regenerating that later as long as I can survive. Survival through regeneration, however, comes at a cost. If you have a situation where the animal uh, has to lose part of its tail or, or, or its toes for some reason, then it has to put that energy into growing that, that limb back. And that energy could have been put to growth or reproduction, yoking up eggs or movement and going and looking for food and that sort of thing. Out in the field, Smyers regularly find salamanders with missing limbs, tails, and toes. And it can be a, a good indication of the levels of predation that they may encounter. If, they're, if, the, if you have a, popula a sample size of 25 animals and 20 of them are missing part of their tail, then there's probably something trying to eat them. So what did we learn from our salamander search? Their ability to regenerate is a result of necessity. It also gives hope that other complex animals, like humans, can someday do the same.